Hi everybody, Cynthia with Swan Soap and Such. Today I'm going to be making a soap with lots of clays. And we're going to fragrance it with this lovely scent, which is like the Nag Champa that you hear about. Very musky scent. And this is for a special request. Of course, I have my fragrance in my kale and clay here, and I'm using a red French clay and a brassoul clay in a swirl, hopefully. So I haven't used this fragrance before. We're soaping at about 80 degrees, and my lye is ready here, and it has a um, little bit of lye lint, so we'll filter that out and we have organic sugar and also sodium lactate so we will filter this out into our oils and our lye mixture will go right in we'll put that over there and we'll get started Give it a stir first. Make sure we don't have any bubbles. Okay, we have reached emulsion. A little bit of green left over from my previous soap, I see. So we'll grab that out of there. Must not have cleaned that as well as I thought. Okay. Now, I don't know how this behaves, but we're going to just put it right in and mix it in our batter. And hopefully we'll have a beautiful soap. Smells nice and musky. We want to get all of our kaolin clay in there. We're going to have part of the batter is going to be a natural soap color, and then we're going to have the two clay, um, the two clays. Now our batter is getting a whiter color with that scent in there. So that's interesting. <coughs> Now let's pour out, this is our Rasul clay, and I'll show you that one, the brown, it's a nice brown, it'll come out a little tan, and we have the red French clay, and yes, it is from France, I will show you that in a minute, so mostly we're going to have the clays, so we'll do a bit of that clay, and a bit of this nice red clay. I want to have a little bit more of the red. And then we'll have some natural. So let's stir this up, see how we do. Clays tend to need a little stick blending because they get a little grainyish so we want to mix that with our stick blender and also the rasul clay which is a nice brownish tan beautiful all right so Rasool looks like it mixed in really well, but let's give it just a little blend and make sure that we have it all mixed in good. That actually looks pretty good. So I think I'll go on to the red French clay and see how we do here. a little bit more. 
like we need to scrape it down. Let me move these up so we can get into the picture. We need to scrape down from our sides, get all that soap batter down into our soap. seems to be um, behaving very well. Sure smells good. have the most of the red clay. Let me stir it, make sure the bubbles have gone out. Oh yeah, that's a really nice consistency. And the brown Rasool clay. Some people pronounce it a little differently. That looks really nice. And the regular A little bit more bubbles in it, so we gotta stir them and then they'll hopefully come right out. Okay, we'll start with our red clay. And we'll pour this in. Do I want to pour it all in? Hmm, I think I do. Except for a little on the top. So, that looks good. Now we'll do some drop swirls with the brown. And the natural. Get a nice blendy blendy. And you pour the rest of this. Pour the rest of the brown in there from up high. And we'll let this set up a little bit. And we will do some design on top. So I'll bring you back. Okay, it's been about four minutes and we're back and let's see, how do I want to do this? What should I put first? I think I'll put the red in first and 
We'll just do lines down the soap. We have plenty to make lots of lines. Tan. Don't forget the tan. Rasul. Yes, we want that in there too. Smells pretty good, you guys. I haven't smelled this one before. As I said, this was a request to get this particular scent, so I ordered it. And it is pretty nice. Now let's get the rest of this white on. We can do a nice figure eight, maybe. See what we can do with this. Got a little bit of a mess here. We will clean that up. Okay, so let's see. Let's see if we can do a nice swirl on top just to make it pretty. Now this is a natural clay soap. So I'm not going to put any glitter on it, but I think we're in good shape. What do you think? I'll bring you down to look at it. That would be fun. Okay, hold on and we'll come down around the table, lift up my camera. So you can see it. I think it's quite beautiful. What do you think? Pretty pretty. Okay guys, I'll see you at the cut. Thanks for watching. God bless.